Hello, I'm Carlos from the technical support team. In this video, let's start with the basics. Downloading your wallet, restore your Byron wallet, create a Shelly wallet, and transfer your funds from your Byron wallet to your new Shelly wallet. First of all, download your wallet. It is important that you do this only from the official Dedalus site. Because of the success of Shelly, there is a high likelihood that the scammers will be trying to target people. So use only official sites and links. Come to dedaluswallet.io, click on download, and choose your operating system. In this case, I am on macOS, so I am downloading this version. Click on the file and wait for it to download. Open the installer and install the application as you do with any other application. When the installation is complete, open the Dedalus mainnet. The first time you run it, Dedalus will need to verify the entire blockchain. This process will take some minutes. If you had some wallets on previous versions of Dedalus, those wallets will be loaded for you. Your balance and transaction history needs to be synchronized with the blockchain. You can track the progress in the message that is above the summary and transaction tabs. Once your wallet is synchronized, you will see this red banner. This is important. In my case, CLR-IO is a Byron legacy wallet that does not support Shelly delegation features. To earn ADA from delegating your stake, please move all your phones from this wallet to a new wallet that is Shelly compatible. Since all your wallets are Byron legacy wallets, you will first need to create a new Shelly wallet. So let's create a new Shelly wallet. To create it, you need to click in this white button, create a new wallet you will be prompted to this screen that you are probably familiar with. Click on Create. Your wallet will need a name, so let's name it Test Shelly. You need to set up a spending password. Make sure that it's something that you remember and that is at least 10 characters long. When you're done, create Shelly, check the box, read the message please carefully, and click on continue. Dedalus will display a 24 word passphrase. Please write it down and when you are ready, verify it. Check the boxes and confirm. Your Shelly wallet also needs to be synchronized with the blockchain. This process will be a lot faster this time. So once your wallet is synchronized, you are ready to transfer your funds from your Byron wallet to your new Shelly wallet. Note that on your Byron wallet, the send and receive tabs are disabled. So to transfer your funds, please click in this white button, move ADA to an existing wallet. Click here, and from legacy wallet, CLR-IO, to a Shelly compatible wallet, test Shelly, the wallet that I just created a second ago. If you have more than one Shelly wallet, those will be here as a display list. When you're ready, click on continue, and you will need your spending password from your Byron wallet. Click on transfer fonts, This will create a transaction, and it will take a couple of seconds for it to make it to a block. There it is. The transaction has been processed, and as you can see, my funds have been moved from my Byron wallet to my new Test Shelly wallet. 
So this is it. This is how you transfer your funds from your Byron wallet to a Shelly wallet. The Shelly wallet gives you access to this delegation center where you can choose any stake pool to delegate your stake to. So there we have it. Your brand new Shelly wallet set up, funded, and all ready to start delegating to a stake pool and earn some ADA rewards. Keep an eye on our more videos to come, outlining the delegation process, picking a pool, and lots more. See you then.